all the things that come in trees I have named. Now I have shoes, sandals, and slippers. The shoes is the part in the life I have lived. The sandals is the part of my stage in life. And the slippers is the pleasures I have sought. Now all these I surrender for the sake of solitude. That what we seek for the solitude is the appreciation arising between anticipation and realization. Seeing this will release, seeing this will release us from all earthly connections. Therein exists the solitude. The eternal appreciation comes with. I will go, I will get, I will become. The student who ignore the becoming will come to know the eternal appreciation. Practice indifference in the event you are so capable. Imitate solitude to be sure you can manage it. Let's see it was the 18th June 2024. I dreamt that I went to work and I was told only watch what the workers are doing. I walked around, I look, I see the workers in various places engage in activity and then I see a train as if coming straight towards me. I lean back against a structure, looks like a lamppost. As the train got close to me, I moved aside and the train turned and leaned on this lamppost and then went away. Now, what we see in this, when we see activity, immediately we recognize the situation and we anticipate the objective and plan for a becoming. If only we can ignore the becoming, then we can catch the anticipation arising, the anticipation for engagement. At the same time, when we see the emotion arising, this is the train that is coming to us. We can step, step aside. The train of emotion will go to one side and therein lies the possibility of solitude. It is like being awake and asleep. Thoughts are loudest when the airs are asleep. The exercise to ignore is possible only while we are awake. You get to the with source with the stories you make up. And on arrival to the part of activity, on arrival, the part is release. Silence, which is the source of thoughts, will not lose. And speech, which is the source of emotion, will not win. It is like waiting. The crane and the tiger are locked in battle for the egg. The crane fights to survive one day while the tiger fights to vanquish. The egg is the becoming of any activity. The crane is the thought comes to mind and the tiger is emotion rising. They who are so capable will get it. However, there will be engagement in the world enough to keep the body. Solitude is a state of mind, but we need a body to go along with the mind. Therefore, we engage enough for the life. I am Atan Raj Indranath, interpreter. 